the administration was wrong to stand by a statement sympathizing with those who had breached our embassy in Egypt instead of condemning their actions. It's never too early for the United States government to condemn attacks on Americans and to defend our values. The White House distanced itself last night from the statement, saying it wasn't cleared by Washington. And that reflects the mixed signals they're sending to the world. The attacks in Libya and Egypt underscore that the world remains a dangerous place and that American leadership is still sorely needed. In the face of this violence, America cannot shrink from the responsibility to lead. American leadership is necessary to ensure that events in the region don't spin out of control. We cannot hesitate to use our influence in the region to support those who share our values and our interests. Governor, some people have said that you jumped the gun a little in putting that statement out last night and that you should have waited until more details were available. Um, do you regret having that statement come out so early before we learned about all of the things that were happening? I, I don't think uh, we, uh, um, we ever hesitate when we see something which is a violation of our principles. We express immediately uh, when we feel that the president and his administration have done something which is inconsistent with the principles of America. Simply put, having an embassy which is, has been breached and has protesters on its grounds, having violated the sovereignty of the United States, having that embassy uh, reiterate a statement, uh, effectively apologizing for the right of free speech, is not the right course for an administration. Last question.